At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. You'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. Kentucky Power is reporting that it will take several days before power is restored to customers affected by flash flooding. Heavy storms overnight Wednesday into Thursday pounded eastern Kentucky, not only flooding homes and blocking roads, but also leaving more than 23,000 Kentucky Power customers in the dark. And Kentucky Power spokesperson Cynthia Wiseman says restoration crews are facing many of the same challenges as everyone else. Certainly, restoration will be delayed because of the high water, and uh, you know, it's more rain is expected. Maybe not like what we had overnight, but more rain is coming, and um, we know that this will be uh, a multi-day restoration effort because of the conditions. Right. At this time, there is no estimate for when power will be completely restored. Wiseman says the first task is to get a clear picture of what will be needed. You know, we do damage assessment first. So we're in that stage right now, figuring out um, what the extent of the damage, uh, how many poles are broken, where they are, what kind of vehicles are needed. You know, does, is it truck accessible or is someone going to have to climb, you know, manually climb a mountain and carry poles or, you know, those kinds of things are what, what goes on in the early hours of storm restoration. And then as we get a little more uh, clarity around that, we can start to project restoration times. But I can tell you that it will take several days to get everyone restored. And just like when Kentucky power crews head to other regions to assist in disasters, outside power crews are currently heading to eastern Kentucky to give help here. We help out other companies not only the AEP sister companies, but ones, you know, like you said, in hurricane-affected areas in the south and Florida and places. Um, and then they come and help us, too, when we when we need it. So I know that crews from Ohio are going to be assisting, and I imagine other states, too. Wiseman also warned customers to make sure it is safe to reconnect their homes to power, especially if they have suffered flood damage. For customers who have received damage flooded to their homes, you know, they're going to have to be in a position to receive power safely, too. So if their electrical uh, wires were affected or the breaker box or if their service drop to the um, um, their house was affected, I mean, it may take some time for them to be able to receive power. So there will be a lot of individual cases that we will be addressing, too, I would imagine. Reporting in Pikeville, I'm Ralph Davis for Mountaintop News.